Hi guys, so today I'll be showing you how to measure how much gallon of water your pool can hold. So for that you need to know the dimensions of your pool. So measure the length and the width if you have a rectangular pool. And if you have like edges like this, guys, don't don't worry too much about it, you know, doesn't doesn't matter. Uh, just measure whatever the best you can. So in my case, um, my length of the pool was 30 foot and my the pool was about uh, I think it was 14.5 foot um, now what you need to do is you need to measure the average depth so the depth could vary right you may have uh, three feet here you may have five feet here so take an average uh, of the of both figures right and uh, so in my case my average came out to be about 4.1 so 4.1 foot was my average depth for my pool <clears throat> and I have the same um, almost the same uh, configuration so anyway so the the formula for that is uh, you're gonna do length times width times your average depth this is the formula and uh, you take that number so in my case, uh, my length is 30, my width is 14.5, and my depth average is 4.1. And that comes out to be 1783.5. So this number is the cubic feet of water that your pool holds, and then you're going to take this number so in my case 1783.5 and I'm going to times that by 7.48 now the 7.48 is the gallons in uh, one cubic foot so once you multiply these two together you're gonna get the total number of gallons your pool holds so in my case it comes out to be about 13,340 and 58 gallons so this is how much my pool holds so again it can it's not 100 percent accurate but it's very close to what your pool is holding guys so uh, again length times width times the average depth will give you the cubic foot of water and times that by uh, 7.48 which is the gallons in one cubic foot and that will give you the gallons of water guys if you like this video please subscribe subscribe to my channel and like the video